Welcome to Gamer Ability. I'm your host, Six Penny, and gamers, Mario Golf Super Rush is finally here, and I'm gonna get my hands on the game for the very first time and provide you with my first impressions on the gameplay. We're gonna be diving into the first part of the golf adventure mode and for those of you that are new to the channel i play a whole lot of sports games and especially a whole lot of virtual golf so i'm excited to dive in, in a different change of pace an arcade game instead of that simulation style we're used to but i'm really excited if you get some enjoyment out of this video and want to see more mario golf content be sure to drop a like before you go i'd greatly appreciate it and consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on all of my new videos in the series. Let's do this gamers, let's dive into Golf Adventure. So let's see, let's, let's just start it with, we have here, my homies, my me characters actually. So Ryan Gamer has been sucked into this universe. Here we go gamers. So here we go, it's actually a story, that's pretty sweet. Oh, it looked like Mario just won! Isn't that the end of the tourney? Uh, did you see how he won? That was ridiculous, I need to see a replay. Some slow-mo. Oh, sorry Chuck, but remember the welcome ceremony tomorrow is more important than watching TV. Eehehehehe, <laughs> Birdo's right. We should all get some good sleep tonight, I feel like we're going to need it. Thank you, how wonderful to have at least one sensible rookie in the house. Hmm? I'll sleep just fine. What about you? I didn't even know ghosts could sleep. You don't just fall through the bed. <laughs> Chuck, I feel like that's a rude question to ask a ghost. Anyway, I guess I'll go to bed. I want to make a good impression at the welcome ceremony tomorrow. That's a good idea, dear. I know you're hoping to be one of the standouts in this rookie class. Bah, she can't outdrive me. Sorry, Toadette, but you're always gonna be playing catch up to the real heavy hitters. Bah ha ha. Aww. Excuse me, you can't always win with your power alone. You know, you've got to keep a level head and know when to lay up. Oh, we never lay up. Eehee <laughs> hee. You've both got it wrong. Finesse is the name of the game. Boo knows. It's all about that finesse. There we are. Oh, it's you. We've been waiting for you. Come join us. Please, does anybody know why the name is Mahomies? On Nintendo wow. Switch? Everyone, please allow me to introduce the final rookie in your group, Mahomes. That's, you already know, it's Patrick Mahomes. <laughs> so Ryan Gamer becomes Mahomes in when he gets sucked into the Nintendo universe. That's pretty cool. You're a rookie too? How much did you overhear? I mean, nice to meet you, Toadette. Wow. Uh, trying to, we're, we know Toadette's strategy. Yes, the golf associate called to let us know that one more rookie would be arriving late. Now they're here. All right, all right. So how far can you drive it, Rook? You want to tee it up and see who wins? Uh, please. <laughs> Don't mind, Chuck. He's got an oversized driver for a brain. <laughs> Come on, everyone. You'll all be learning together, so you might as well introduce yourselves properly. Hey, yeah. The name's Charging Chuck. I hit the long ball. Boom. Don't matter where it goes as long as it goes far. Giddy up. Uh -huh. I'm Toadette. I'm great to meet another student in the game. I hope we can all learn from each other. I don't know how to do Toadex accent, gamers. <laughs> I'm Boo. Um, Boo. He. -he. Okay, he's, he's kind of freaky. That's it. Yeah, I'm out of here. I'm going to lift anyway. If you want to hit the green, your biceps got to be mean, says me. Huh? Well, I was on my way to bed. The most important thing for strong muscles is recovery. I don't understand the obsession with muscles that seems to plague those of you with physical bodies. Anyway, off to bed, hee hee hee. And brag about it, boo. Brag about it. We have to go with actual muscles and such. That is quite a crew. What am I thinking? You must be exhausted. Why don't you head to your room and get some rest as well? Okay, let's go to bed. Oh, but I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Birdo, the camp house mama. Hello, mama. You can even call me mama if you want. Okay, we will. 
Now, your room is one in the back. We've got the big welcome ceremony tomorrow, so go rest up. Okay, we need all the rest we need because we're going to win this golf tournament. Oh, so we have a little house. So there's Charge and Chuck's room. Can we go kind of mess him up for the tournament? There's, oh, right living next to a ghost. Yeah, it's kind of intimidating. Boo might play some tricks on us. Okay, there's the bed. Turn in for the night. This is cool. Got to figure out an accent for Toadette, right? For all the characters. Meet the manager in front of the clubhouse. We're gonna go. We're gonna go whoop. Ah, you're awake. Good day, Mahomes. I hope you're feeling rested. Did you get a good night's sleep overall? Yeah, we, we did. Okay, did it wake you because you seem like you really need the rest? We did. Running late for the welcome ceremony. Head outside and straight down the road. Hurry. Okay. Oh, just one more thing. We need golf clubs. Everyone in town knows that we have a new class of rookies starting out. So you'll have a lot of eyes on you and some pretty high expectations. Just put your best foot forward and take it in stride. Good luck. Appreciate that. Ryan Gamer now called Mahomes as he got sucked in. So Ryan Gamer is a multi-sport athlete in the real world plays PGA Tour, play, is in MLB as well, and he got sucked into the Mario universe because they wanted the be they needed the best golfer to save the universe, the Mario universe. So that's why they called Ryan Gamer. Here's we talk to these. Hello, welcome to Bonnie Greens, birthplace of the golf in the Mushroom Kingdom. I know you're a rookie, so you've probably been hearing this a lot, but this place is legendary hallowed grounds. Can't tell you how many folks I've seen arrive as rookies and leave as golf heroes. That's us. We're going to be a golf hero. Well, look at all these look at all these great characters here. We're just gonna go. We need to focus and get on the golf. You're the rookie everyone's talking about that's right. Yeah, that's us. Bony Greens has world-class practicing areas and courses. Golfers travel from near and far to play here. Bonnie Greens? Bony Greens? What, what, it's Bonnie Greens, right? It has to be Bonnie. Did I say it wrong? The bullet to port over there has a detailed map of everything. Take a look. Let's do it. Okay, so it looks like oh a clubhouse. We have a cafe, a pro shop, a rookie course, practice area, course entrance, okay, home. This is cool, like an open world golf. But if this is anything like the Mario Tennis, so I played Mario Tennis, the campaign was really short. So my guess is gonna be short. The head coach, hey there, I'm guessing you must be Mahomes, am I right? That's us. Great, nice to meet you. Now listen up, Rooks. The welcome ceremony is getting started. Get in line, hurry it up. Okay, wow. Let's not be too harsh. Looks like everyone's here, coach. Welcome, rookies. Now surely you all know the storied history of our club. No, I don't. But a reminder never hurts. Bonnie Green's Golf Village is the birthplace of countless legendary golfers. Why did Boo look at us? I hope you all realize how lucky you are to get a chance to write your own chapter in the Bonnie Green story. Oh, we're excited. I'm the clubhouse manager here, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to this rookie class. Now, you've just met our head coach. He has a lot to offer, so I hope you take his lessons to heart. After all, he's launched the careers of several top players. Well, we don't really need a coach. Ryan Gamer knows what he's doing. Hey, thanks for that. Now you all are here for a reason. You've got the raw talent to make it in golf, but that doesn't mean it'll be easy. I'll help you make the most of your potential, but you got to put in the work. Ryan Gamer always puts in the work. Very well then, I'll go ahead and pass these out. They don't know that Ryan Gamer's already won the Rookie Grand Slam in PGA 2K21. This is called a golf watch. Rookies, it'll track your stats, record your scores, and a whole lot more. Very cool. Come on up and get one when I call your name. Charging Chuck. Yo, he says. I hear you drive the ball a little bit. Let's see if we can teach you some control. Control, that gonna help me hit it further? Uh, charge we, we don't have to worry about him. All right, Toadette's time. Toadette is there. I hear you're pretty crafty in the leagues playing golf like it's chess. I can't wait to see how you do. What are they gonna say about us? I'll give it my best, coach. There's Obu. I hear you're supernatural with control that can make up for lack of power. Lack of power? I'll show you the true meaning of power, okay? Oh, you mean my golf swing, e. Okay. Oh, boo. Oh. Gamer here, I hear you're a real prodigy. 
but rough around the edges, just like the fairway, I guess. Ha, I just made that up. You know, yeah. calling us, you give compliments to everybody else, but you say we're rough around the edges. All right, that's enough for intros. Go ahead and slap those new golf watchers on your wrist. All right, here we go. Your data's already in there like magic. Just press on and make sure it looks right. The first screen that comes up should be pretty basic, just your overview and stats and stuff. Don't worry about all the advanced functions right off the bat, just take your time and get familiar with it. Now I'm going to go over the badge system, okay. Ah, you see where it says still badge? One day when you reach the top it might say platinum. That's the best badge there is reserved for real pros, but we're going to be that. The path to improving your badge runs through tournaments. Your golf watch will update if you earn a new badge. Thank you, coach. Now I'd like to introduce another member of our team who would be helping instruct you. Is it Mario? Where's Mario? Oh, Toad. Toad. Hey, everyone. I'm Toad. I've been looking forward to this for quite a long time. Golf is more popular than ever in the Mushroom Kingdom. Wasn't that tourney yesterday incredible? I don't know. But if we want to keep the sport interesting, we need some green players, you see. And I don't just mean folks who can hit the green. We need some fresh faces on the leaderboards. That's where you all come in. We've scouted each of you for your special talents. Maybe you'll be the next big star. And they brought us in all the way, you know, we got sucked into the Mario universe, Ryan Gamer did. We'll get updates on your progress directly from your golf watches as you earn better and better badges. Of course, you'll need to practice hard and focus on your skills. Listen to your coaches, they're here to help. But with hard work, anything is possible. Maybe you'll be the new star of the tour. All right, all right, that's it for the welcome ceremony. Can't wait to see you all on the links. Yeah. Oh, Mahomes. Oh, they need us. The Caddy Master wants to meet up before you head off to practice. Caddy Master? Yes, I almost forgot. Just head down the path to the left a little bit. You're in for a treat. Hey, hey. Yo, oh. Don't look at me. I'm not going to spoil the surprise. Go take care of this, and then we'll hit the links. Okay. All right, let's do it. Let's take care of it. This is kind of a slow start. But I like it. It's building the story. Press start to open your golf watch menu. From there, you can return to the menu by pressing... Okay, let's do it. Oh, uh, so here's the golf watch. Oh, look at the full map here. Okay. So we, you can improve your stats. You can look at your equipment. We're in everyday golf attire. We have no golf clubs yet. Okay, let's do it. They love to talk. Oh, there's the caddy master. You are Mahomes, right? Well, right, gamer. You all just like to call me Mahomes. I've been waiting for you. Oh, I hope they didn't sound weird. Now, you're here. You're here for the package, aren't you? Yes. Was that a yes or a shrug? You don't have any idea what I'm talking about, do you? Uh, no. Oh, your first set of clubs. Give me something good. They're already customized perfectly for you. Not bad, not bad at all. Now when you're playing around here, you'll be chasing after your ball on your own two legs, no cards. Ooh, I like that. Seems hard to carry around your clubs at the same time, right? Well, don't sweat it. We won't load you up with a full set of 14 clubs. Do you have to buy them later? We'll start you off with seven, which we call a half set. You can carry more, but it'll cost you in terms of speed. That's kind of cool, gamers. All right, that's enough for me. Go ahead and strap on that bag of clubs. Yay! Look at us, we are ready. When, when using half sets, it's important to carry clubs that fit your play style. This set should serve you fine for now and don't worry, it includes a driver, good. Yeehaw! Just come back and see me when you want to change things up, okay? <laughs> Last but not least, take good care of these clubs for me, will you? We, we'll, we'll, we may break them a little bit if we get upset. I think that's it. You're a full-fledged rookie now. Why don't you go try out your clubs at the practice area up ahead? We just want to play some golf. So that's kind of cool. So you can customize your golf bag and you sacrifice speed by carrying more clubs. Let's do this. Where are we playing? Oh, uh, practice range here. Practice? Ready to learn how to hit the driver? Yes. Do you want to be the base of hitting shot? I might as well. Okay, left to aim. Makes sense. Up to overhead view of where your shot will land. Because that that's Y. I mean X. I get confused. The switch controller is all backwards. The inner circle shows where the ball will land. Slash carry. 
and the translucent border border shows where it will roll. So that's run. Oh, very cool. Where it will land, and then it shows land and roll. The sum of the shots carry and run equal its total distance. Distance is also affected by shot power, wind speed and direction, elevation change, and landing area. We know that. Press B to activate the shot gauge, or oh, that's A on, the, on this controller, and then press A again to set the power of the shot. Okay. Now, that is pretty straightforward exercise. We'll be aiming at a target in the fairway with your driver. By the way, you'll need 60 points to pass this lesson. You'll get plenty of opportunities. The idea here is to hit a tee shot that sets you up for an easy par and hole. That target represents a great place to end up on the fairway for your next shot. I would guess, gamers, those of you familiar with my golf game, we're going to hit more fairways in Mario Golf, right? I hope so. To get a precise, the blue section of the target will score you the most points. Of course, that isn't always the best spot to be. That will depend on the win. We, yeah. For now, aim for the blue area. We'll start with five shots, but don't worry about scoring 60 yet. You'll get five more shots afterwards. Okay. So I need to come up a little bit short. We can see the Y button here. Let's do this. And then it looks like the second one is for spin. Be the drive. First drive in Mario Golf. Can we hit the fairway and stay in the... Oh, that was perfect. Oh, uh, that might be too far. That might be too far. It might be getting a 7 instead of 10. And I am going to do a video doing the motion control round sometime. Oh, perfect. Which I, there's no wind or anything. It should be easy, right? Nice it's so weird getting used to, you know, you, I'm used to analog controls with PGA 2K21 and just do it going back to the classic button pressing and timing. And Mahomes is a natural, Ryan Gamer, you know, he, he's just a natural here in Mario Land. I mean, what? how awesome is that for Ryan Gamer? He, he gets to become his favorite player in sports when he gets sucked into Mario. They call him Mahomes. Like, that's how good they think he is at golf. Nice shot. That they call him Mahomes, his favorite player. Like, that, that has to be one of the biggest honors, right? Stay, stay, stay. There we go. Okay, this is pretty easy. So how did that feel? Were you able to hit the shots where you wanted? Oh, yeah. All right, next we'll hit five more shots, but now you're ready to get more aggressive and set up for a birdie. Oh, we're getting more aggressive? Okay. Here, we gotta roll out further. Let's get aggressive. Oh, we missed it. Nice shot. It's not gonna get there. It's gonna land short in the seven. It might land in the eight. Go, 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 go. Oh, at least we got eight. That's perfect. So you can nice shot, shot shape with the left stick there. So that's how you can put extra spin on the ball if you want to. Beautiful. We're we're gonna hit fairways in this game. <laughs> so let's see here. Let's let's do a little bit of spin on it. So I did I did a lot of front spin on it. And let's see what happens. If it rolls all the way up. So we took off distance. Well. Maybe that's not for top spin. Maybe that's to control the a little forward. Should be nice. We are racking up the points here. He's showing them that he's here to stay. Ryan Gamer doesn't joke around out there on the golf course. Nice shot. Beauty. Can it get to the 10? Come on. Go. Ah, oh, so close. Nice. Okay. 93 points, 400 coins. Level two? Oh, yeah, we probably need to help power. We got to go. Mahomes needs to go for that. Just be able to crush it. Lock in stat changes? Yes. So, B button to dash. You did it. You scored 60 or more, and that's a passing grade. Those are some of the best driver shots I've seen, rookie. You've really got a handle on this. Thank you. That's a big compliment. I see a very bright future in this game for you. Toad says, good job, Mahomes. To keep improving the accuracy of your shots, you need to pay attention to both carry and run. Want to learn how that works? 
I mean, I guess, if you want to tell me. Oh, we, we already know carry and run. Yeah, we already learned this, Toad. To turn into how far to carry when a shot we tell... We'll peel on the gauge, but factor and run. Okay, yeah, we know this. Let's go play. Now we're going to the practice area here. Yo, ow! Do you want to take a beginner approach lesson? Yeah. Yes. Do you want to view the basics? Might as well. Shot taken from off the green when they attempt to stop the ball on the green. We know that. Press Y when using a wedge to hit a half shot. Okay. Travels half the usual distance. All right, let's start with the basic 30 yard approach on flat ground using, you guessed it, approach wedge. In this spot, you could try a bump and run where you chip the ball into the green and let it roll toward the hole. It's 10 yards to the green and 20 yards to the hole. After your shot lands, it will roll a bit, so if you aim for 30 yards, it will end up past the hole. Your shot power determines how far the ball will fly until it hits the ground. This is what's called carry. Yeah, we got that. Situation, you want to fly the ball about 70% of the way to the hole. After it lands, the ball will roll or run the rest of the way. If you can consistently stop your approach shots within three feet of the hole, you'll be in great shape. Oh, we're ready. We know this. You know, Ryan Gamer's an expert in golf. You know, they, they don't know that here. They don't know that yet. We know what we're doing. Make the first shot. Okay, okay. We're just a, we're just a natural here at Mario Golf. Let's go in again. Yeah, this this may. <laughs> I know this is just a level shot on flat surfaces, but we are showing. I mean, Ryan Gamer is making a great impression in his first day in Mario Land. I mean, he really is. Like he's coming in swinging. He didn't make them all though. You passed! We're looking at the same distance as before. We're about 10 yards from the green. The hole is 10 yards. Okay, we got this. 30, 30 yards of elevation gain to count for. That means you need the shot to carry a little further. Last but not least, for the easiest possible putt, try to stop the ball in front of the pin. It's easier to putt uphill than downhill. That is true. Let's do it. So we have a little bit of elevation here. So we need to hit it a little bit harder. We'll see if that's too hard. It was, so a little bit too hard. Eight points, so we'll take it. This might be perfect. Go in a hole, come on. We still, we still beat it. I mean, these are easy to beat, though. I, I, and I noticed the lie angle is going off a little bit to the right as well. That's in. Here we go. Let's go. Nice. Okay. We, we know what we're doing, right? Try to remember everything you learned about hitting shots off inclines like that. Pro shots are just as important as putts. Yeah, they are. Pretty easy to overshoot your target when it's downhill. The hole is one yard downhill and eight, 98 feet away, which means you want to ease back on the power. We got that. Three feet of the hole. Ten or more. Because we need to take a little bit more off of it. So we are looking at 35 yards away. Or less than 35. Let's try that. Beautiful. Okay. We are ready. Okay, uh, it's it's just a nice change of pace from PGA. I'm ex I'm so excited. Like the the nostalgia when playing this game, it just brings me back to some memories as a child playing the Mario Golf series, the original one on NES. Nice. I mean, great memories here. I played so much the, of the the Mario Golf 64. Me, I mean, we just played so much of that game. Let's go. So there's power, stamina, speed, control, spin. Let's keep doing power for now. Just so we can show them that we're here to stay. We're here to smack it. 
You nailed it. Guess this was easy for you, huh? Well, that's it for your approach work for now. What do we got now? Beginner putting lesson? Okay. We got this. Putting requires more precision. We know this. We, we are a putting master. You don't have to worry about line and speed. Line is where you aim. Speed is how hard you hit the ball. X to select between short, medium, and long putts. Okay, like the old games, the grid on the green shows the higher level. Yeah, we got that. The points of light flow from high to low. Greater elevation change resort in more points of light. Okay. Very short putts can be tapped in simply by pressing left on the D-pad. Just tap it in. Let's set our target at 16 feet for the ball. Try to imagine a three-foot circle around the cup. Our goal is to get the ball to stop just inside that. We got it. We're one of the best putters, right? Ryan Gamer, really good putter, I think. <laughs> Can't ask for an easier putt to start out, right? There we go. Beauty. Nice. If we miss though, I mean, if we can't make those putts, right, we, we might as well retire. That seemed either was way too easy for us. But 60 feet for this time, the green isn't flat. I'd say it's a baby hill at one foot. Try to nudge this one so it stops within three feet, okay? So it's a little bit uphill. Ah, too short. We still got 10 though. There we go. But hey, a 10, a 10's a 10. So one thing I used nice. to love in the Mario Golf is uh, putting. Now, I am i don't think this game has mini golf though, which the old ones had, and I loved mini golf in the series. Now it's bump up the challenge. This is straight 16 foot uh, downhill, and we got this. Good job. Look at Gamer. Ryan Gamer Mahomes here. <laughs> Mario name Mahomes. You know, they wanted it to start with an M, they said. You know, I get it. Nice. Doesn't affect Ryan Gamer any to have a new name. Like he he loves he loves Mahomes. Another stat increase. So should we do power again? Oh, if you increase power more, you decrease speed. Oh, if you increase anything, we, you lose speed. So let's increase speed a little bit. So that we can be good at speed golf. If we're going to shot, you can press right yeah. R to look at elevation. Okay. Nice touch. You messed all downhill putting. That'll do for that lesson. Okay, I'm ready to play. Putting yeah, challenge Mario. here. Okay. What are we doing? Super lob shots don't fly as far as lob shots, but they have it. You've got nine shots to score at least 80 points. Should be easy, right? I think we hit that a touch too hard. It's still gonna go in though. You gonna give me a harder putt? <laughs> I mean, do you know that we can make these all day? And you can fast forward as well. Okay, this is easy. Oh, I didn't know it was uphill. That's what I get for saying that it's easy. <laughs> well, at least it's a 10, but we missed it. Crush it. There you go. Wow, you have to hit that hard. Now downhill. Might be too soft. Oh no, we're good. These are so easy, though. Even though I know we missed a few, but that's because I didn't pay attention to the break. I was so used to just hitting it straight. Challenge complete. All right. Nice. Okay. But you know, you're leveling up your... Oh, that's two level. We got two points. So let's do power... And 
Maybe control? It's always good to have control. I don't know how many points you get. Like, can you max out your character? Or prob you probably can't. You probably have to... Oh, uh, we're good. Let's let's go try the rookie course. Let's go play some golf, right? We're we're done with the training. I'm ready to play some golf. I don't know about you gamers. It's a long intro. I'm sure the other videos in the series are gonna be a lot just mostly golf. It has to introduce you to the game. You all are learning all the mechanics, I'm learning all the mechanics with you. Let's go crush this rookie course. So you passed the basic lesson already, that's great. Now you're ready to play a few holes. Yes, we are. How to shift, how shift can affect the action, yes. Shots can shift based on a variety of factors, including power, line, club selection. Shift is displayed next to the shot gauge. After setting a shot's power, shift is determined at random. If you set a shot's power in an area of the gauge with low shift, so I see the shift at the top, you'll get more accurate result in terms of both distance and control. Okay, so the further you go for more power, it's going to be random random deviations, random shift. The area of the shot gauge with the low shift is called the safe zone. If you set a shot's power in an area of the gauge with high shift, it'll be less accurate both in distance and control. Okay. The area of the shot gauge with high shift is called the wrist zone. The exclamation mark icon would display it if you set a shot, okay. To hit an accurate shot, use less power and aim for the safe zone. When hitting for bad lies, like out of the rough or bunker, the safe zone will be smaller. Oh yeah, you can see that. The bigger the wrist zone, the more likely it is that shift will end up affecting your shot. Longer clubs like the driver have smaller safe zone than clubs that don't hit the ball as far. Consider both safe and wrist zones when selecting a club and how shift could affect the distance and accuracy of a shot. I like that. Great, so this is pretty simple. You're going to play three holes on the rookie course, finish in five over par or better to pass. That's it. Don't worry about running from hole to hole just yet. Focus on making good shots and scoring under the limit. Okay. I like I like the the shift area there. Wind speed 11 miles per hour, downhill 7.3 yards. A nice little flyover. Ready? Let's do it. First drive. Stay in the fairway. It wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't surprise you if if Ryan Gamer missed the fairway first time. <laughs> no, we hit it. That barely rode at all. Okay, so what do we have here? What does it show yards to pin? Okay, so we have it downhill. It's gonna be a little less than 120. So in between 93 and 120. I don't think it shows your distance to hole. Am I? Maybe I'm just missing. I mean, it shows it on the swing thing on the gauge to the right. So we're gonna land it a little bit short and gonna try and make this. I forgot to look at the lie angle. Yeah, we're gonna go too far. Okay, we're gonna be in the rough. The gamer lives in, gamer's used to living in the rough. Like, that's just what he does. So we're in the rough, we need to add a little bit more on our shot. That rough did not affect the ball at all. <laughs> okay, uh, Mahomes is struggling a little bit right now. But he's a good putter. A little bit uphill. Oh, that would have been a big putt. Mahomes. Okay, Ryan Gamer starting out with the bogey. That's kind of embarrassing, isn't it? But you live and you learn. I, that rough did not affect the ball at all. <laughs> Oh, that's not the way you want to start in your first hole. Ready? You know, the nervous jitters were there, right? Nervous jitters. We all get them. At least we can find the fairway, right? 
I like the gameplay though. You know, graphics are solid. You know, it's not not the greatest graphical game, but it doesn't need to be. Okay, let's land it a little bit short. Nice shot. Might be too short. But gameplay mechanics feel good. The game runs smooth, which is what you would expect nice from a Mario game. Birdie. Is this straight in? Oh, it is. There's the birdie. Nice birdie. Okay. Yes, I love the animations. <laughs> it's one thing I've always loved about Mario Golf. All the birdie animations. Oh, can we get a hole in one? Okay, if we lend this 120. A little bit short. But let's go to 143. Three hybrid and land it at the front of the green. It's gonna be beautiful. Came off a little bit to the right. I'm not quite sure why. Okay, now we know the ref does not affect. I mean, the rough does not affect the ball really. So, I think I think that the rough. It's already calculated in the distance there on the gauge. It has to be. Yeah, it has to be. So that one was coming off to the right. Are we gonna bogey the par three? Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. Ryan Gamer struggled out there in his first tournament. <laughs> Ooh, what over nice. par? <laughs> okay, uh. It's because we don't know how to read the gauge, apparently. Two more attributes. We're going to work on power here. And then control. Or speed. We need to, you know, we're going to be a speed golf master. Lock it in. So, apparently, it already accounts for the rough effect along on the greens. You crushed it. Did we crush that test? Right now, surprise for the test. You'll need to complete three holes for the time limit and score well too. You have 10 minutes to finish a hole. Finish a par three, a par four, and a par five. Yes, we can do that. Speed golf. Leave the timer and score keeping to me, Toad. You got this. Running all over the course. Might explain how movement works. Might as well. Left to run. Okay, A to jump. B while running to dash. Okay, do a little dash. Push opponents out of the way. Oh, yes. Press L when your stamina bar is green to special dash. Okay. Let's you run super fast, but use up stamina. If you run into an opponent while special dashing, you can knock them off balance. Very cool. Take a shot. Okay. Yeah, we know that controls. You can keep an eye on stamina gauge. It'll replenish if you take a break from dashing. So try to plan accordingly. Toad, we got this. We're gonna. We're probably going to be playing better in speed golf than regular can't believe we shot one over par are you kidding me 11 miles per hour wind also i forgot about the wind maybe that affected it count for the wind and we're blasting this nice shot. we gotta run i, for I, I completely forgot <laughs> come on mahomes Mahomes is way faster than this. Oh, what a golf shot. So I like this is awesome running to the ball. I should have checked that it was going to come off to the right. It's okay. Read it fast. Hit it in. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, I can't believe that went in. Okay, thank you for giving that to me. Bogey, is that really a surprise? <laughs> Ready? Okay. Uh, can shoot a 15 under in True Sim in PGA Tour 2K21 last uh, this week, but can't shoot Mario Golf. <laughs> that makes perfect sense, right? <laughs> makes perfect sense. I love this, how you can run around. I kind of wish you actually always had to run in your ball, even when it wasn't speed golf. That would actually be kind of cool. Drive little golf carts around. Oh, we can't get there. We can't get there. 
Well, yeah, we can. The control's not gonna be good. But we can get there. Do that dash down the hill. Ah, oh, we rolled over the green. Come on. Get moving. Get moving, Gabe. Gamer's not used to running this much. <laughs> In baseball, you know, he runs a little bit, but not too much. Does it account for bunker, too? Yeah, it, it already accounts for it all. Nice. Uh, okay. It really already accounts for that stuff. That's interesting. Nice par. Good par. The rough and the bogey sand does not seem to affect the ball. Maybe it affects it a little bit, or maybe just Ryan Gamer's that good. Put a little top spin on it. Look at the the boards, the birds fly away. Beautiful shot. We're finding more fairways than we've ever found. Finding more fairways we could ever find. This is fun though. <laughs> Having fun with this. It's a nice change of pace. Let's go. We're going over that tree. So you can see how the, I like how the shot gauge tilts. So it actually shows you which way the ball is going to move based on the slope. I really like that touch to it. It's a nice little. It's really nice for people, that especially aren't familiar with golf. So see, it's going to come off to the left. Come on. Boom. Uh, we, I thought that tree was in play. In the rough. So we couldn't even get that far. You really got to work on your strength. Go in. Not today. Run up that bunker. That was a good shot. A little bit downhill. Send it home. That's a pretty good round. We don't have the distance to where par fives are scorable yet. <laughs> he can barely hit it. Come on, Mahomes. I know Mahomes is way stronger than this. Okay, here we go. Let's do all power. Locking in. He's going to have all power, but no finesse. You passed, nice work, thank you. That means you finished within the time limit, got a nice score to boot. Now you're ready for a qualifying round. Just head to the gate behind the clubhouse when you're ready to give it a try. Even though you can play freely now, don't forget it took what it took to get you here. Keep practicing your shots, refining your techniques. Once a student of the game, always a student of the game. That's right, my gamer's always learning, but yeah, let's go qualify. Let's go qualify. We're ready. Just take our qualifying round and just be ready to go. Wonder, wonder what our qualifier is going to be. Is this it? Welcome to Bonnie Green's main course. Ooh, quali we, got, we don't need a practice round. We're ready for qualifying. Want to learn how to curve shots before starting the qualifying round? Yeah, I actually do want to learn that. In addition to setting a shot's power, you also add curve to avoid obstacles and hazards. After setting the power of the shot, use the left stick to add curve before the club hits the ball. Curve right, okay, or left, or hit a high shot with up or low shot, okay. You can also choose to reverse these controls in the options menu if you prefer. You can add three different levels of curvature to shots. Tilt a little for a small amount of curve, a bit more for medium, and even more for strong. That's really cool, okay. First qualifying round, you'll be golf with two other players and there's a time limit for each shot. So, oh, you'll all play nine holes total and after each shot, you'll need to run to the spot where you're balling it up. To qualify for a tournament, you'll need to score plus four or better. All right, good luck out there. Plus four or better, we can do that in our sleep, right? Oh no. Ryan Gamer's famous last words in Mario Golf. We can do that in our sleep. <laughs> oh no. Why did you have to say that? 11 miles per hour, uphill slope 5. Let's do this. Blast it. Look at us all teeing off. Pink Yoshi over there. But I feel like Gamer is going to have the most power. So speed does not matter here. I don't think. 
I don't think this is speed golf round. We just have to shoot four better. Let's get this heart. You really got to work on that stamina. Maybe that's what I should do next. Help stamina. We beat everybody. Blast it. Should have aimed a little bit more to the left. Speed and stamina just be a speed golf master. Come on, gamer. Keep rolling. Nice. There's one more heart up here we can get. Use special... Oh, we can't use special dash. We don't have it. But we can get this heart... Oh, what a golf shot. We let it right up next to the hole. And we missed it, of course. Gamer. <laughs> That's unfortunate. A par four that we can't even reach yet. We need some new clubs. Okay, the AI is pretty slow right now. Come on, Yoshi. Wow, Toad's qualifying too? <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, to, I'm beating both Pink Yoshi and Toad. We'll take it. Ready? I'm ready. Blast it. Oh no. What are you doing? Oh, it's in the wind. That's actually good. I was trying to do that. <laughs> so coins fill up your special meter in speed golf. I don't see a special meter right now in this mode, so I don't think it matters. So we still went too far. Wait, does that shot meter already calculate for the wind as well? Just like it does rough? I think it does. I do not like that. At all. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe I'm just seeing that. Just tap it in. You know, not <sighs> ideal. We got our first bogey in the qualifying round. I mean, you know, nerves are there, right? We're all tied. Nerves are gonna happen. Par five, let's blast it in the fairway and move on. That's unfortunate. Nice shot. Run, gamer, run. I don't think the coins matter because there's no special shot. Gamer blasted that. Come on. Get the heart. There we go. How are they speeding so much? Oh, you can jump? We can't really get this there, but let's just hit it as hard as we can. Get to heart, and then run. There we go, perfect. Does jumping increase the speed? Oh. Beautiful. Come on. And let's blast this part. Let's put a little curve on it. Let's put a little curve. Put a little draw on it. Did we hit the tree, didn't we? That's that's not ideal. Run, run. We don't need the heart. It's going to come off to the left. I don't know why I'm trying to speed right now. I don't even need to speed. <laughs> We just need to score. Pretty solid golf shot. The uphill lie affected that quite a bit. Basically a straight in putt. We'll take it. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna be going all power because I know the control would be nice, especially when you have that forgiveness area. Good job, Yoshi. That's a par for Yoshi. Is Toad going to hit a par? Let's see. Toad hits a par as well. It is a tie match. What a nail biter here in the first match. Four, so the wind's died down. Uphill 4.3 yards. So I don't need to speed golf. We just need to play casually. Try to win this tournament. 
I tried to hit it higher, higher in the air. Just to, just to see. Just see what happens, you know? Ryan Gamer is always about experimenting, trying new things. One thing I was surprised not to see in this game is there's no online tournaments and there's no online ranked or anything like that. I was really surprised to see that. Nice shot. Like, because in Mario Tennis, you know, you had ranked and you had tournaments. Maybe they'll add that in the future. Hopefully. So I guess most of it, after you beat Adventure Mode, you're just you're trying to beat high scores. Okay, so it's going to come off to the left. Need to land it a little bit short. I put some backspin on it, tried to. Nothing to this, just a little bit of break. Gamer! Imagine saying nothing to this and missing it. A bogey. That is pitiful, gamers. <laughs> are you kidding me? We are shooting two over. Right, gamer, you've really got to improve your stats here in Mario Golf. Let's just blast it, be on our way. We have a few fans over there watching us. Like to see a few more though. You all know, for those of you that know Ryan Gamer, he he knows what he, he likes the fans. That's just what he does. It's all about the fans. I probably need to hit Y more to look at the terrain. Yes, and that's why I probably need to watch the terrain. <laughs> oh, but I mean, we're used to the rough. That's where we live. We live in the rough. Oh, I see what the speed golf is. You have a limit per... Just now saw that. Will sheep eat your golf ball? And we're going to see. Does it count for the rough in the view there? We're going to see. If I hit past the hole... I think it does a little bit, or maybe just this rough is not very deep. Yeah, it definitely accounts for it there. Just tap it in. That's another bo- no, that's a- that's another bogey, are you kidding me? We have to shoot four over or better. Okay, I want to be able to hit the ball further. And all we've been helping is power. <laughs> We can still barely hit the ball. Okay, Pink Yoshi had a nice bogey there. Oh, Toad had a double. So we're still, but they're struggling too. I mean, these are tough conditions, right? We can say that. Nine miles per hour, the wind's picking up a little bit. We have a par three downhill. Let's go to 150. Aim to the right. Be the club. Nice shot. Nice shot. I love hearing that. Oh, roll up to the hole. You wouldn't see it if it was a hole in one. And there's no. I don't. Nice there, I don't on. think there's any replays. It said nice on. It looked like it was dangerously close, gamers. Oh, we almost had a hole in birdie. one. Yes, we'll take a birdie. Nice. Our first birdie of the round. We almost had a hole in one. That would have been awesome. Can Yoshi make this putt? I'm gonna bet no. This is, I am having a lot of fun playing this game though. I like the adventure mode. Uh, you know, I feel like it's gonna be short like they always are. They always are a little too short, but this is fun. It's gonna be a good change of pace from other golf games. We're in first place now. We took the lead. The lone lead. I'm going to hit this lower and see what happens. Huh? Yeah. 
you basically keep keep tapping the left stick down. So 179 plus 20, 199. It's not bad at all. Go 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 go. Perfect. Let's see, 167 to the front of the green. We probably need to put a little bit of left movement on there, a little bit of draw. It was coming off to the left and I wanted to put a little bit of draw. That's going right at it. Oh, it's going right at it. Oh, great golf shot. It didn't give me a nice on, so we're not too close. Oh yeah, it did. Okay, we're good. We'll take it. Okay, a little bit downhill, breaking to the right, consistent. Oh, I hit it too hard. Just a touch too hard. I've wanted that birdie so bad to battle back to even. Look, we are so f fat, so much faster than Yoshi here. Yoshi is struggling. Oh, put that backspin on it though. Can you teach us that, Yoshi? He said, yeah. <laughs> or they said, yeah. She said, yeah. Ready? Oh, in the headwind. It's starting to rain here. Look at this wind. Getting some nasty weather here in the qualifiers. Toad is bad. Like, Toad might not qualify. Four over? It's not looking good for Toad right now. Stay in the fairway. It's getting dark. There's a storm coming. Okay, how far do we have? So we can't get up to the green. It's it's kind of stinks not being able to drive the uh, get to the green on a par four, right? <laughs> That's just kind of tough. I'm not gonna lie. Speed dash is fun. Wow, if you up your stamina and speed, imagine how fast you would be. I bet Boo's fast. I remember in Mario Tennis, Boo could just run circles on you. Which way is it going to the right? I tried to put a little bit of backspin. I don't know if I actually did. Oh, I didn't need to. Oh, the wind. I keep forgetting about the wind. And I think the wind does affect putts. They used to in Mario Golf games. So it wouldn't surprise me if the wind affects the putts. That's another bogey. We are going into the last hole. We have to get plus four better. As long as we don't double bogey, we're in good shape. Toad's happy. So my guess, if it's Mario, so we're playing normal golf now in this campaign. Something's gonna happen, right? Because they, they already told Ryan Gamer he's going to have to save the world. Nice Try to put a little top spin on it. Dash, dash, dash. We're rolling. But I will be completing this whole adventure series here on YouTube. Especially for those that don't have a Switch and you want to experience the full mode. And I don't think it's going to be very long, so it won't be a whole lot of videos. Probably like an hour of video would be my guess is how the length of it. We need... Most likely, I think we're going to have to get better clubs. Wait, there's water? No! Oh, no, gamers. Oh, no. This is not good. Don't fold under pressure, gamer. We have to bogey. We have to bogey. We're going for par on our next shot. Oh no, that would be terrible if we don't qualify because of that. Gamer, you got this. Uphill lie. Uh, this could be dangerous. Oh, no. Nice. We have to make this. I don't think it's breaking. Oh, 
Okay, I did not see any break there. Are you kidding me? Uh. <laughs> I mean, are you kidding me, gamers? <laughs> oh, Mahomes' phone's under pressure. I think that means we probably didn't qualify, correct? Uh, what happens if we don't qualify? Does it matter? Oh, we moved up a lot, though. Okay, we've got to get power. Like, it just has to happen. So, uh, gamers... Ooh... What happened? That score won't qualify, but you can always try again. Love your service by taking lessons in practice area. Oh, you... Yeah, they're telling us to practice. Practice? Well, gamers, um, we didn't qualify in the first video, but that'll be the end of this video. The redemption qualifying will be in the next one. <laughs> that is hilarious. We smacked it in the water. What? Are, you know, does that surprise you? Ryan Gamer has been known to have moments like that to where he just folds under pressure. He's going to come back mad in the next episode. We're going to qualify, continue the story. But thank you for watching this video to the end. I had a lot of fun. It's frustrating that we lost, you know, in the first one. We did not play good. We did not play good in Mario Golf. But the sky's the limit. Ryan Gamer, Ryan Gamer's going to get it down as he starts to be able to hit the ball further and play better. But you all are awesome. Be sure to drop a like if you got some enjoyment out of this video. And subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. And turn on all notifications to stay up to date on all of my Mario Golf Super Rush videos. And all of my other gaming content as well. I post every single day and live stream as well. So stay tuned. I will see you in the next video. As always, have a fantastic day gamers.